I, I saw something great today. You know, I saw some. I saw people stand up for their rights. I'm here to support our countries, Israel and the United States, and Jesus Christ because He is in charge. Only Him can destroy a world, a country. Not Ahmadine, whatever his name. I don't even care to pronounce it. I can't pronounce it. The evil devil snake. I don't know. He picked a good name. Ahmedinjad? Ahmed? I've heard it so many different ways over the last five days, it's not even funny. I'm not giving my name except for free thinker, and I'm standing here for to exercise my right to free speech. <laughs> I'm a U.S. citizen, and I live in the United States. I have the freedom of speech. People in Iran, they don't have freedom of speech. He's coming here, and he's taking advantage of our liberty. Yeah. That's, that's all. And you? Me? I uh, just happened to be here. Okay. I'm talking about Ahmadinejad now. I'm not talking about our president. I'm not talking about our president. Today, Ahmadinejad is here. That's why some of us are here. You want to protest against Bush? Fine. I don't know why the left is in protesting against Ahmadinejad because he's repressing journalists, he's repressing the Baha'i faith, he's repressing women, he's repressing homosexuals, but that's okay with the left. It is the height of hypocrisy for George Bush, for the U.S. government, and for Zionist student groups to shed crocodile tears over the reactionary Islamic fundamentalist regimes in the world. Go to Iran, find how many Jews you can find who are practicing and f feeling comfortable and safe to practice there. Doesn't happen. Count how many Baha'is, how many Zoroastrians have been killed there. And then put up a f***ing sign that says, religious diversity in Iran. That's a lie. Who's putting up these signs? He's not the leader of the country. The, the leader of the country is the supreme leader of the country, an Ayatollah, okay? He's the religious leader. And when he speaks, and when he speaks at large demonstrations and rallies, what he says and what they chant, what they repeat and what he says is, death to Israel, Death to America. I'm part of College Republicans at Hillel, but my views do not necessarily reflect those of the groups. A lot of people were able to see a number of sides to the man. I think that they were able to see how ridiculous he is when he says, you know, there are no gays in Iran, and when he questions the Holocaust. But I think also he was able to to extend his hand to a lot of the members of the liberal population here when he was sympathizing with the Palestinian plight, which a lot of people on this campus really do sympathize with. And so people were able to look at him and say, you know what, we don't disagree with everything that he says, we just disagree with some of it. We have to have dialogue. We must meet and talk. It's you know, very important. We are living in a globalized, convoluted world. And we must not be confrontational. You can't reason with evil. You can't debate it. There's nothing to talk about. They want me to accept the, a so-called fact that six million Jews died. He's just like Ahmadinejad. What is this? It's ridiculous. Who denies the Holocaust? Someone that's that ignorant, I have nothing to say to you. Yeah, how do you know? Maybe you are ignorant. No, ignorant. He's got six. Yeah. You're slaughtering the poor, defenseless, long-suffering Palestinian people. And what do you expect them to sit down and ask and take you're, you're, you're entering a whole different argument. No, 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 it's all part of the whole thing, my friend. They wanted a hate fest to happen today, and it did happen. I don't want to uh, participate in a hate fest towards any person or country. He can't make no bomb. You think God going to let him destroy Israel, the United States? That's the birthplace of Jesus Christ. He's not going to do it. He can't do it. Today, my reaction is... Uh, I gotta say, I'm really proud to be an American today. Anything else? That's it. You wanted to go out with me tonight? <laughs>